in space, providing better space for tomorrow. 21वीं सदी के आधुनिक भारत की विकास यात्रा में एक शानदार अध्याय जुड़ा है। Indian National Space Promotion and Authorization Center, यानी इन स्पेस के हेडक्वार्टर के लिए सभी देशवासियों को और विशेष करके साइंटिफिक कम्युनिटी को मैं बहुत बहुत बधाई देता We at InSpace are committed to implementing the vision of our Honorable Prime Minister, Sri Narendra Modi, and taking India's participation in the space sector to a leadership level. And India's first privately developed launch vehicle, Vikram S, launched successfully from the Indian Space Research Organization's Sri Harikota Spaceport. The mission named Param, or the beginning, marks the Indian private sector's first foray into the promising Space launch market developed by four-year-old startup Skyroot Aerospace. The launch of the rocket will mark the foray of the private sector into India's space industry. In space is working towards building a robust and reliable space ecosystem that will enable and accelerate the country's space economy. Space business uh, requires three most important things. That is the technology development with a zero defect and reduce the turnaround time for developing the technology. Last year, InSpace took many initiatives to create a space ecosystem. One of them was Space Simulation and Design Lab, and EV mechanism for transfer of technologies developed by ISRO, and catalog of all the ISRO facilities. InSpace is going to see a lot of activities, uh, especially uh, for the authorization of uh, various space activities by both government as well as non-government entities, especially in the areas of uh, satellite communication, earth observation data dissemination, as well as for the authorization of the launches. Uh, when we are now making uh, the launch uh, manifest uh, of for the next year, uh, we have already received more than 10 applications from the non-government entities for launching their satellite through Indian Launch Vehicle. Total investment so far made in Indian space startup so far, cumulative, is of the order of $100 million. USA I gets 20 times that much in one year. So we wow. also have to show some success. And mm -hmm. one of the values of today's launch is that once mm -hmm. to start saying yes, something now is happening. Yes, mm -hmm. these startups are going, starting baby steps and trying to demonstrate that Indian startups mm -hmm. can uh, perform in mm -hmm. space. Then money mm -hmm. will start. The entire range is provided by Sro at Sri Arikota, you know, state-of-the-art uh, launch facilities. In fact, uh, we are the inaugural launch for a new launcher, uh, you know, uh, at Sro. In fact, uh, such world-class infrastructure was made available to us. Uh, and uh, then the kind of preparations, uh, you know, which uh, uh, the Sri Arikota team has done for our launch is like as if, you know, they are part of this mission, part of our team, and we're doing it with common spirit for the country. Well, in one sentence, the space policy basically removes almost all the restrictions that the private sector had up to now in participating in the space sector, they can do anything. They can build satellites, payloads, launch vehicles, they can have their space ports, they can do earth observation data, they can do data dissemination applications, whatever they want to do. Uh, and therefore, that's what the policy does, is uh, basically make the whole space sector as a playground uh, for the private sector. Well, it's certainly a, a sort of a milestone event uh, for the Indian space sector. Uh, clearly a big uh, uh, starting point for in space itself uh, to be able to uh, uh, authorize two companies and launch their uh, uh, their payloads on uh, ISRO C-53 uh, PSLV launcher. The year 2023 has been a milestone year for the Indian space ecosystem as the recent space policy has galvanized space sector reforms to take India to the highest level. Looking ahead in the time I foresee, 
in space will bring ease of doing business in space sector to accelerate space commercialization project india as a global manufacturing hub work towards skill development of private industry and academia to achieve आत्मनिर्भर भारत गोल्स इन स्पेस नाइन महीना पहले यहीं पर प्राइम मिनिस्टर साहब मौजूद थे इसी रूम में और उन्होंने बात की थी कि हम किस तरह से स्पेस को एक अप्रोचेबल बनाएं प्राइवेट सेक्टर के लिए और मैं कहना चाहूँगा कि पिछले दो साल में जब स्पेस सेक्टर खुला गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया ने तब से आज तक काफ़ी कुछ हो चुका है टाइम आज कम टू अपग्रेड ourselves in this domain in terms of the observational capability that we do not have today it has to be created in india the analytical tools that we need to create has to be worked upon uh, in the days to come with the more data that is going to come by the creation of this observational capability it is indeed a new beginning a new dawn and i like shall i say very appropriately as our team members have put it a new prarambha Through its public and private participative model, InSpace is also working towards building a culture of space technology and innovation by collaborating with students and academia. CanSat is our first step in this long journey. InSpace's digital platform is the one-stop destination for all our stakeholders to reach out and contribute in India's space dream. InSpace has also been working on policy framework for revised fdi policy technology transfer from isro to ng and third party liability the policy frameworks it's been a very exciting and eventful one year for in space starting from creating a small committed passionate team to bring in confidence in government's intent on moving the space sector forward in a very rapid manner all stakeholders beat the ngs the academia media investors uh, internal government people they are all excited about what is ahead of us from the ngi side we have seen suborbital suborbital launch we have seen spacecraft launches we have seen experimental launches and a lot of things that are in the pipeline that will happen during the coming 12 months so we have a lot ahead of us exciting times ahead and we are all in it together let's enjoy the journey in space me भारत की स्पेस इंडस्ट्रीज में क्रांति लाने की बहुत क्षमता है